Black Widow doesn't care about the truth. I know you're like, what you mean? A Jezebel just wants total control. They don't care about the truth. They, they live in lies, manipulation, deception. They don't care nothing about the truth. Matter of fact, they don't care nothing about the truth to the point where they lie about things that they, they don't need to lie about. Think about that for a second. So you with a person, you dating a person, or you best friend with a Jezebel, they will lie about things that, like, I'll give you a simple lie, simple lie. Let's say y'all supposed to go out on a girl's date night out. You always have that one friend that's late, but usually she the same one that said, oh girl, I just left my house. But actually, she ain't even got out the bed yet. She hasn't even gotten dressed yet. Y'all already at the restaurant or the club, whatever the case is, and she hasn't even left yet. Because she don't care about your time. She don't care about you. But we don't think of it like that. Well, that's just Sarah. She's always late. No, Sarah is always late because she know y'all gonna sit there and wait for her. And then y'all still gonna pay for a drink. I'm not a woman. I'm just, I'm just saying just saying what the Jezebel does. And y'all sit there and let her get away with it. Again, it goes back to accountability. So we're not holding Sarah accountable. Sarah gonna continue to be late. And it's not until you stand up and be like, you know what? You know what? I'm going to leave if Sarah not here in an hour and y'all all pack up y'all stuff and leave the club or leave the restaurant and Sarah shows up and nobody there that's when Sarah gonna finally get the point Jezebel like I said they don't care about the truth they don't care nothing about that they live in lies they love to lie they love to lie I ain't talking about lie down I'm talking about they love to lie they do that too but I'm just saying let me jump back into the chat I see y'all chatting a lot in here let me see something let me see let me scroll up just a little bit not too far let's see Jab say, isn't that the truth? The lady who does that on my job reports absolutely everything everyone does to the managers. <laughs> and she's probably the nicest person. She's the nicest woman at your place of employment. But does each, her heart is evil. Her mind is evil. But she comes off so nice, but she's the snitch. She's telling on everybody trying to get all y'all fired. I work with a lady like that when I work for KBR not rap. Did the same thing. She would just, she was nicest. Like she'll go get you lunch, all kind of stuff. Old the lady. But as soon as something happens, she's the first one the manager will pull in and she would tell on everybody. So I had to I had to call out one day. I was like, man, I can't remember the lady name, but back in 09, I had to call out. I said, man, look, if you go tell on me, you might as well tell on me in front of me. Yeah, there's no need in you running behind and going to tell the manager and this, that, and third trying to get me fired. And what I did was, so you got to know how to set people up and play games sometimes. So what I did was, being that she was, she had been there for years. Now, I ain't set the woman up to get her fired, but what I did was, I realized that was a Jezebel.